As I mentioned, it's my biggest project so far. I can't afford for it to go wrong. So some of you know, I'm in the process of doing a uh, development over in Kent. I'm just in the process of trying to find the right person to take on the project. So I had a number of people booked in to come and give me some quotations and to do some analysis and a crazy incident happened. So I'm probably going to tell you about that later on, but I managed to get it done today. I think I bought this from my mum for Mother's Day a few years ago, but I ended up stealing it back from her. It's actually really good. Hey guys, hope you are doing well. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. I'm going to be spending more time on this channel talking to you more about development, about property development, about taking your business to the next level. Look, I'm relatively a newbie, not in property, but in the development side of stuff. I've done a number of refurbishments, I've done a few conversions, but this happens to be my biggest project so far. So I spent today speaking to different contractors, trying to find who the best person is, um, trying to find the right contractor, the right builder that's going to help me develop this specific project. I can't lie to you, it's quite daunting. I don't want to make the mistake of picking the wrong person that's going to pull the wall over my eyes, that's going to do the job wrongly, that's going to mess shit up and mess things up and run off with my money. So I am slightly worried. Um, these are the things some gurus might not tell you about, but the reality is there are people that are trying to take your money <laughs> by pretending they can actually do the job. I'm trawling for a number of reviews. I've asked four of them that came over to give me an analysis today and to give me a quote today. I've asked each of them to provide me with five people that they've done some work with. That I can call up and find out some more information regarding the past projects that they've done as well. And I intend to call every single one of them just to feel a bit more comfortable to see whether they are the right people to do this job for me. As I mentioned, it's my biggest project so far. I can't afford for it to go wrong. I know things do go wrong. One person stood out specifically to me out of the four. But at the same time, as I said, I can't let emotions get into it. I gelled well with the person. But again, that's not enough for me to give them this entire project. Because if shit goes wrong, then shit will go wrong. So I've got to be cautious. Speaking to one of my good friends, who's also a developer, he said, make sure you get reviews. Some of them will be angry. Some of them will be peed off. Um, but the ones that don't give you the reviews, you can use that as an easy way to discount them. Whether they sound great and their image and their pictures um, are fantastic, use that as one way to eliminate the group of people. So I've asked every single one of them to send me an email with five of their past customers and I will call every single one of them. Um, Again, VAT registered is another thing. Again, that doesn't give any form of certainty, but I'm just looking for a certain size of business um, that can actually handle this as well. Um, insurance, these are the things you've got to find out. Are they adequately insured? What sort of insurance? Ask to see the policy. So everything I'm telling you is based on what I'm learning as I'm going in this project as well. Um, I'm no expert in development. I can't claim to be, um, as you can probably see, I'm still nervous as well, but you know what it is. You've got to jump. You've got to fly, you've got to take the opportunity and um, I'll let you guys know as I get more information, as the quotes start coming in, um, I know some of them are going to range from here and some are going to be up here as well. But again, I hope it inspires some of you to take it to the next level. It's taken me four and a half, five years to get to the place that I'm now doing bigger developments as well. So I am proud, but I'm also scared as well. But I will definitely update you guys. Please like, comment and subscribe. It definitely helps to put my content in front of more people as well. And hopefully a builder, a contractor, just someone um, might actually see this video and they might contact me and they might end up getting the bid to actually carry out this development look i'll catch up with you guys soon peace